Hi, Valder BB. Good morning, Dion Call. You're live on the Valder BB show here in Dallas, Texas. Hey, well, I'm glad, glad to be here. Thank you. Well, thank you so very much. I'd like to let my listening audience know that the Emmy nominated Dion Call, you know, he's using his masterful take on observational comedy mixed with real life situations for his weekly riff on pop culture in a new Dion Cole's Black Box. Congratulations, Dion. Thank you so much, Valder. I really appreciate it. Thanks for having me on the show. I'm excited. Well, we, we love rising stars on the Valder BB show <laughs> because my destiny is to help other people get to their destiny. And so the Valder BB show seems to be that kind of bridge, a little small, tiny one, but a very, you know, a little bridge. And I think Dion's cold black box, I think you're onto something. Thank you very much. I appreciate it for helping me out with your bridge. I appreciate <laughs> it. <laughs> but yeah, I'm excited about Black Box. You know, it's a show, a weekly show where I talk about pop culture, what's trending, what's in the news, what's on TV, what's on the web, and uh, just give you my take on it and, and my perspective. Do you do- Go ahead. I'm sorry. No, no, that's it. Well, I want to find out, do you do serious and funny? Or, or you kind of like, and, and, and this is just an example, John Stewart, you know, he, he takes serious stuff and makes it really ridiculous, which I, most of <laughs> the time it is. Yeah, I mean, that's basically what you do is uh, take something and you bring awareness to it and then make light of it. And that's what we do. That's what I've done on Conan. For, for years, and, you know, we're just taking that, that same element and making it into a show. Okay, if I threw some things at you, like the IRS just released this video with the people line dancing. I guess that's what they were doing, or the Cupid Shuffle, I think is what it was. <laughs> what would you say about that? <laughs> there goes our <laughs> taxpayers' money right there. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I think they should have paid to dance lessons. <laughs> dance lessons. They take our money and get dance lessons. <laughs> <laughs> and if I threw out maybe the Kardashians. That's a lot of fodder right there by itself. Oh, yeah. I mean, I mean, wow. I mean, just the Kardashians, period. Like, making money, doing whatever they do. I mean, like, who? as much as people want to look down on them, people got to envy that. You know, like, they're making money breathing. Like, I would, I, lo- I know. I would love to make money breathing, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I think that's why people envy that. I am so surprised at the people, even on my own teams. If we, I remember the first time somebody on the team says, "Oh yeah, I follow that religiously." I was like shocked. We're spiritual thoughts going following the Kardashians. Right, right, right. I mean, it's just one of those shows, one of those families you just can't get enough of. It's a guilty pleasure, you know. So I mean, hey, if you can make money at that, I will salute you do it well you have such a great platform if you're pulling from the headlines like you did on conan and 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 using this for a show this is what our culture is so much about they want to know you know what's your take on pop culture i got my take what's your take so where did the idea come from for you to to morph this into a show it was me and my partner doug carroll we used to sit together he was also he also worked on conan and we sat together and we just put some ideas that I had and he had that Conan didn't want, and we put, we put it together and came up with a show or whatever. You know, uh, Conan is our all in all. He he has um, a, a person that we 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 love, admire. Without him, none of this would be possible. And we 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 learned from him and we took what we what we learned and made a show and. And um, we presented it to TBS and the rest is history. You said something key, and I just want to go there just for a moment. You say you learn from Conan. Uh, uh, people have the opportunity to be in what I call the energy of greatness, and, and, and that's people who already ascended to the top. Once you get to that energy of greatness, do you become so aware and you truly learn from them? Or are you just there, this is just a job, i got to get to the next level? Or do you truly learn from them? I mean, I, people go about things differently. Me personally, I'm I'm like a sponge. Like I've I've always been the type of person where, if I'm the smartest one in the room, I need to be in another room because I cannot learn. And I like to teach, but I love to learn as well. And with Conan O'Brien, 
which is a legendary writer who wrote for Saturday Night Live, The Simpsons. He had his own talk show. He's been on TV for 21 years, graduated from Harvard University, plays three instruments. I mean, why, why would I be around him and waste that opportunity to learn or gather any information? Like every day I'm around him, I learn about something new all the time. One of the greatest things he told me was, you know, every moment can't be magical. And if every moment was magical, we wouldn't have magical moments. So that led me and made me to believe into, you know, if I have failure, failure is good. It just prepares me for that magical moment. Well, you are so much a darling. You're going to be the darling of TV and pop culture, Dean Carl. I truly, truly am so uh, honored that you took the time to st talk with us here on the Valder BB Show. I really Thank am. you, Valder. You're, you're, you're the greatest. Thank you so much. No problem. Tell me when you want to win and where you want us to watch Dean Cole's Black Box. Yes, it's, it's 10 o'clock on TBS. Please watch it. Please watch it. DVR it. <laughs> Whatever, please, please, please. And thank you so much for your avenue, sharing your avenue with me. Thank you. Thank you so much, Dean Cole. I look forward to great things from you. Thank you. Cheers. Bye.